Reef DVM's coming at you today, and today we're talking about dealing with a little tank trouble. You know, at Reef DVM's, as you know, we're also farmers, and farmers during the month of August can be busy, and uh, that makes a little trouble for the reef tanks. This happens to be a bad month for us, um, nothing that we can't overcome, but unfortunately we're out baling hay and putting in water lines and so forth, and the uh, ultra-low nutrient system um, took a little bit of a header on us. Uh, as a matter of fact, uh, we changed out... Um, some phosphate removing product at the same time that we were changing some of our calcium and alkalinity pumps and a couple values got screwed up and as you can see there on some of the uh, coral there's some white bleaching um, back there on that uh, Kenya tree leather there it's it it just looks bad it's supposed to be floating in the breeze matter of fact you can see all the little floaties in the tank that is dead material coming off things there like the um, the, the branching coral on top uh, it just the bird's nest is is just bright white. I mean, it, it just bleached to death. It's it's really sad. Um, years worth of work um, and things have died. Our our Duncan colony here. I, I know it's a little bright with the lights on it right now, but the back colony might be able to survive. Um, the front colonies will do fine, but uh, definitely took a hit. And, and it happened just overnight. This is the quickest thing. Um, the center colonies here in the center are doing absolutely fantastic. Um, no problems there. But down on the ground again, some major issues. I don't know if you can see it back here, but Torchy is, oh, he's white. He's dead. Um, it's just, it's extremely unfortunate. Again, uh, some of our more frags there, you can see some white branches on them. Just, ouch. I mean, uh, had a diatome bloom on the sand bed instantly. Um, there's, there's dead material floating all over the tank. Uh, here's frog spawn. Um, one colony there looks a little green towards the bottom, and of course, you can see the bleached out branch there. That that piece is dead. Um, it was just it was an overnight mistake. Uh, we just weren't watching things. Uh, things got manipulated and changed quickly. And uh, now we're coming up against uh, Macna here at the end of the month, and um, we've got about uh, you know a week's worth of work to get things back up and running. So we're not the only one that encounter tank troubles, folks. But it all comes down to husbandry. We appreciate you watching as we um, continue to fix our issues here we encounter. Thank you for subscribing, folks.